We didn't think that we were gonna have a wedding until about a month ago. And looking at everyone out here now, I'm so thankful yeah, that so we cool. did and we're thrilled. We can't wait to just be. <laughs> Cheers! First, I'd like to begin by welcoming and thanking every one of you for being here on this happiest of days. It's no accident that each of you is here today and that each of you was invited because you represent some, someone important in the individual and collective lives of Sharice and Miguel. I truly can't think of a better venue than this beautiful little piece of paradise in San Diego for an occasion that I know is not only monumental for the couple, but to all of us who are lucky enough to know and love them as individuals, but even more so as a perfect pair. Cherise, the love of my life, my very best friend, on this day in the city we fell in love in, I take you again to be my wife. So some people say that the first year of marriage is the hardest, but from my experience, it's been the best year yet. I thought that after six years together, I would know what to expect in a relationship with you and that marriage wouldn't be so different um, and it would be the same, but you have grown into a better partner than I ever thought possible. Okay, Sharice, my baby sister, I love you so much. You are such a loving and caring person. You deserve your perfect person. And Miguel, I believe you're that perfect match for her. For Miguel, I remember the first time I met you. Um, so Sharice was visiting me in Hawaii and Miguel was there. And at that moment I knew that Sharice was smitten, even though they were just friends at the time. Um, I already knew it was something more and I, I could just see how happy she, and goofy she was. So I was like, oh, this is, this is something more. Um, and now here we are, it's been years, and you guys have both traveled the world together. And if this year, first year is any indication of your marriage as a whole, I know that both of you will continue to be incredibly happy together regardless of life's twists and turns. Oh, <laughs> you look so good. You look good too. Hi. I'm so happy. You, we made it. It. <laughs> you look really good though. Oh, okay. I like the bow. Yeah, worked out. It looks really good. <laughs> <laughs> you look so good, baby. <laughs> I promise to support you, love you, and grow with you in all that you do and with whatever life brings our way. At first, we were just friends, having a great time around each other. At first, it started slowly, and then all at once. Thank you for being an amazing partner and my rock, for being calm during emergencies, taking care of the chores that I don't like to do, <laughs> and seeing the details that I miss. I thank God every day that you are the one I'm sharing my life with. So here I am today, promising to be your biggest supporter, faithful partner, and best husband I can be. So I continue to vow to love you, be faithful, trusting and respectful to you, and give you endless foot rubs, to encourage your growth and endless hobbies, and join them. <laughs> to give you a ton of love and attention, but also respect you and your alone time. I vow to improve myself so I can be a better partner, and to continue, of course, to be a great dog mom to Zoe. <laughs> We'll start with Reese. When I first met her, I thought, wow, she is really sweet. How did Mikey get her? <laughs> She's always super sweet, always super optimist, optimistic. And then you have Mikey. He's a big old, big brooding dude, mysterious. Just look at him. You don't even know what he's thinking right now. But that's, what perf that's what's perfect about these two, you know? Reese is so sweet. She's like jelly. 
Mikey is so salty, like peanut butter. You know, like a PB and J sandwich with like Zoe shaped bread pieces. You know, that's that's what they are. One of the things that I love most about you guys is how much you both love to explore and travel together. You guys have made so many memories together and I'm excited for all the new adventures to come. So now I'd like to ask everyone to raise a glass to the happy couple. And Miguel, we'd like to officially welcome you to the family. Again. Again, in front of everybody. <laughs> and may the two of you adventure together forever. Cheers. Thank you, Cherise, for always being the generous and kind little sister that I don't deserve. And thank you, Miguel, for being my sister's surfing buddy, Zoe's dog dad, and most of all, for continually making Cherise incredibly happy. I am excited to see where the rest of life takes you both. Uh, cheers to the happy couple. So, Reese, thank you so much for being an amazing woman and loving my brother. Mikey, thank you for just stepping up and being a man, you know? And uh, may God bless you too with so much more than what you have now. Only a few people know this about me, but I'm like super religious and before work, before anything we do, I always like say a prayer. And the beginning of it always goes like, I hope my family, friends, and loved ones, I pray for their safety and health. And I'm so happy you're all here because you're all the people I pray for. And we're just so happy and thankful for you guys to be here. We pray for Sharice and Miguel that the love that they shared today will continue to flourish and grow. And may all of us who participate in this celebration you carry your joy and love with us as we move forward. In your name we pray, amen. Miguel and Sharice, having witnessed your vows of affirmation and all who are assembled here, go forth and live each day to the fullest. You may now seal your vows and confirm your continued commitment and love each other with a kiss. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you, Sharice and Miguel Montilla.